I therefore ask the Congress, above and beyond the increases I have earlier requested for space activities, to provide the funds which are needed to meet the following national goals. First, I believe that this nation should commit itself to achieving the goal before this decade is out of landing a man on the moon and returning him safely to the Earth. No single space project in this period will be more impressive to mankind or more important for the long-range exploration of space, and none will be so difficult or expensive to accomplish. Apollo was the answer to President Kennedy's challenge. Apollo 7 returned America to space after the Apollo 1 tragic fire. Apollo 8 took man to the moon for the first time. As for all the people back on Earth, the crew of Apollo 8 has a message that we would like to send to you. In the beginning, God created the heaven and the Earth. And the Earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the deep. Apollo 9 tested the lunar module in Earth orbit. And Apollo 10 would be the blueprint for the first moon landing. Commander Tom Stafford and pilot Gene Cernan would take the lunar module down to within 10 miles of the moon's surface. Hello, Apollo 10, Houston, over. Uh, Roger, Houston, Apollo 10, you can tell the world that we have arrived. John Young orbited in the command module Charlie Brown while Stafford and Cernan photographed and mapped the path for Apollo 11 in Snoopy, the lunar module. Color television allowed the world for the first time to see space as the astronauts did. With mission accomplished, these three men returned to the Earth at 24,791 nautical miles an hour, a record they still hold. That's one small step for man, one Apollo 11 completed our lunar challenge in July of 1969. Apollo 12 made a pinpoint landing that November. And Apollo 13 became NASA's finest hour when a deep space rescue was needed to return our astronauts after an explosion in space. Apollo 14 was the last walking mission and returned America's first astronaut, Alan Shepard, to space. Apollos 15, 16, and 17, all three expanded our understanding of the moon with workday long explorations on lunar cars called rovers. The first phase of our moon exploration successfully ended. Apollo, America's greatest triumph and the 20th century's moment of glory.